the soil plant atmosphere system, uh, trying to understand how the bioenergy feedstocks affect the system as a whole. And one of the important things is the inputs and how we manage these inputs. Uh, the first thing we addressed here is uh, the amount of inputs, particularly the nitrogen, how nitrogen affects biomass growth and yield. So we are looking at different rates of nitrogen and three different species, say for example, sorghum, switchgrass, and mixed grasses. And we are testing five different nitrogen levels, anywhere from zero kilograms per hectare all the way to 225 kilograms per hectare. And we are trying to identify the optimum doses of nitrogen for these different feedstocks uh, across Oklahoma because we have different soil types and weather conditions. And these would uh, definitely modify the amount of nitrogen doses that we need. And another important aspect when we apply nitrogen to the field plots is uh, loss of nitrogen both from the soil after applying and also over long term. So what we do here is we measure the nitrogen fluxes. As you see in these chambers uh, put out here, uh, these are capped whenever we want to measure the nitrous fluxes from the soil. Uh, the students come here and they uh, take the samples at regular intervals to monitor the amount of uh, nitrogen that's escaping from the system because the nitrogen that escapes into the atmosphere is another important greenhouse gas and it's more potent than the carbon dioxide that we are putting into the atmosphere.